All right, what's up YouTube? Welcome back to another episode down at the river off Red Mark while we're trying to be safe and keep out of the flood. So let's go down the river or up the river both ways either way. Check out what's happening still and maybe go check out some of the other spots. So let's get to it. It is unbelievable how much the water has risen in two, two days, three days. You want to add some clips here? Uh, we'll swing around to the other side of this building and keep going. Alright. Other side of the building. AKA the club.
Well, we can't continue this way. So, let's get on to the other side of this building. If anyone here has seen my last video, you can really see the difference between then and today.
This is completely nuts. It's nuts, but it's cool. Let's keep going up a bit further and I'll pull out the camera again. Okay, I didn't even get that far. But the water has literally broken the wood levy. It's bubbling. Up. It's actually bubbling up through the pavers. No, they're baby fishes. Yep, no, they're baby fishes. I think these videos are going to start getting insane very soon. Alright, I'm going to get back on the bike, go further up, see what else there is. But I guarantee I ain't going to get that far. Alright, we made it down to the waterworks. I'm not, even, oh, I'm not sure what this place is called. I know it's got something to do with water. But yeah, the water is high. I think the river's higher than me, so that's saying a lot.
sorry about some of these camera angles. I'm trying to wheel a push bike and give you the video. So, hey, we do have to do what we have to do. All right, let's get on the other side of the water trust or whatever it is. Yeah, water irrigation trust. Let's get on the other side and we'll pick it up again. All right, let's continue the tour. We're on the other side. Honestly, I'll upload the other footage while I was riding down here. But honestly, I don't think it's changed. It still looks the same. Oh, bagger. Here we go. Alright, it looks like nothing's changed down here, so I'll stop recording here and I'll pick it up when I get back down to where we started again. So, I'll see you there. Alright, we're almost back to the, where we started from, but don't forget, if you're liking this sort of video, hit the thumbs up, hit the like, hit the subscribe, you know the whole dr drill, but let's keep going and see what we can find. Alright, let's start our recording. Let's get going. So, follow as many fence lines as we can. Hey! All the creatures are coming out so we actually have to be more careful than normal right? I don't know what's happening. I think I just hit stop. Where are you now? There you are. Alright, sorry about that. Butterfingers. Trying to get thumb shots, thumbnails. But yeah. Little lizards. But if the lizards are out, but it's going to be a scorcher today. But lizards are out, the snakes are out, so we won't be going bush today. I'll keep that one for maybe tomorrow, then we'll hit the levees. See what's happening. Check out some of the bike tracks around. See if they're, <laughs> yeah, what's happening there with the bike tracks. <laughs> but yeah, let's keep going. Let's leave this little fellow alone. Welcome to my channel. Now seeing that lizard, I'm very on the lookout now. information center then I can start recording let's get over there 
All right, we're on the other side of the information center. At least we got it. good vessels to get out of here if we need to. Yeah. Don't know if I would trust it, but she does go out every now and then. Not lately. If you haven't actually noticed, I'm actually rocking a GoPro on the helmet or a cheaper version. If you would like to see the footage that comes out of this today, hit the like. Well, yeah, hit the like button and I'll upload this one just as a visual, no sounds, no nothing, no me talking, it'll just be the footage. So if you'd like to see that, Just hit the like button and I will upload it. So let's keep going, let's keep exploring. Oh, it's getting harder. We'll see if we also can get into a few spots that technically we shouldn't. So that would be when we get there. May have to remove shoes, but we'll work it out. The water's come up a lot. Oh shit. Let's get up onto the road. Which isn't the smartest option to do, but oh well, here we go. Up we go. I guess no one's getting on the houseboats anytime soon. If there were people on there, I guess they've been evacuated, moved on. Right, let's see if we can get down there a bit more. This is um real. You're gonna, oh, I should put up a tally on how many times I say this is unreal, but this seriously is unreal. This is absolutely nuts. All right, got to get around all these properties, so you know the drill, I'll be back. Don't forget, if you want to see the footage from the camera up on the head, hit the like button. 
It's as simple as that and I'll upload it. Not like there's not much that else you're going to see then me riding. So let's get moving. All right, we're back on the other side. Oh, I don't know if we're going to get in here or where I wanted to get to. Uh, nope, not happening. I'll take you as far as I can and no further, leaving the bike there. Just over there is the little island just before the Big Four Caravan Park where you can go watch the wildlife and everything. I'm going to guarantee it's underwater. If anybody's got a picture of it, can you please drop it in the comments? Or even send it to me if you through Facebook, YouTube. Whichever way, if you can send a picture to me, send it to me. I'll much appreciate it. But damn, this is insane. This is crazy. I actually think Red Foo said it properly. Let's get ridiculous. This is ridiculous. And it's still only the beginning. Alright, let's get out of here before I get in trouble. Because we don't want to get in trouble. No, no. We'll get over to the bike, get back on the bike. And we'll continue. Hey, look, I didn't, I didn't walk under. Honest, I didn't walk under. But, uh. Alright. If anybody knows, you can see I'm slowly heading towards Paringa. We'll stop off at each bridge. Which are normally bone dry. I'm grateful for the bike, but it makes it a little harder.
Ah, what's just done? I'm done, so yeah, can I do it without stopping you? No, gotta stop you, be back. Alright, watch this back on. Let's keep this going. Oh, this is bonkers. Anybody want to have a picnic? This whole setup is right next to the big four caravan park. So, you'll see what they're working with as a levy. Actually, I'll just give my arms a bit of a rest because I've been holding this camera for, or phone, non stop, bloody noisy trucks. Been holding this camera at phone for quite a while now, so I'm going to give my arms a quick break to and just get up the road near the big four, which is right where that car just pulled out. So I'll pick it up there. Now look, a video idea, or a video I did do, but I guarantee I'm not doing any time soon. People. And it just keeps going. This is the levy to the big four. Whoop, car. I wonder, can I use the bike? Sorry about the camera, camera angles. But if you want the angle, you gotta try. Now, right, here we go. As high as I can get. Oh, walk way town centre. Um, I ain't going that way. As you can see, you ain't entering the bike track on a bike. So, don't even think about that because I don't know if I can even do this or get away with this, but I'm going to try it anyway. I'll park the bike just over here and then I'll try and run across the road to give you the shot. Alright, All right, hang on. Just waiting for the cars to go past. We're trying not to show people your car. Sorry if I do get it on camera. Oh, motorbike as well. But I guaranteed everywhere over there is water. There you go. Water is 
literally everywhere. So the single track is physically gone. The walking trail is physically gone. Better get back. Whip. So at the moment there's one track down that I know of. Ow! Pedal. But yeah, that one track down. There is a car rent park entrance to the place. But I guarantee that's totally wiped out. Because, hey, that's what flooding does. It doesn't spare nothing, won't stop nothing. So, I'm just gonna stop it. Oh, hang on, we're coming up to the entrance now, so I'll swap camera angles again. Murray River National Park. Oh. How some of these YouTubers do this with the sound of vehicles and everything every day? I don't know. But here we go. Oh, I nearly lost it. But yes, you are not even coming this way. We have single tracks on both sides of the bus all the way in here. And now hmm, we might have a kayaking course. I don't know about the cycling or walking. But yeah. It ain't that far from the road. And it's, this is just going to get higher. And I'm hoping to be out here daily, second every second day. Trying to record all this because it's a once in a lifetime deal. Uh, but right now, I need a toilet break. Alright, that's better. Listening to water flow all, all this time got to me. I tried holding, but didn't work. Oh well. Alright, let's continue up the road, get to the Paringa Bridge, and we'll have a look from around that area. There's more on the other side again. There was another track out there that I believe is underwater. Underwater. But we'll soon find out when we get there. I think we got one, maybe two more bridges to cross. Run across the road. Not get hit by vehicles. Alright. Back on the bike. Let's keep going. Alright, we made it to the other end of the Big Four Caravan Park. As you can see, the levee just kept going right around the whole property I don't know how well I can zoom in on that more levee right over there which swung right around connects here to protect them from well the main river and this But hopefully their levee does hold up. But honestly, I don't see any of the levees helping. But I'm not an engineer. So I'm just a stupid YouTuber. <laughs> yeah. All right. And this water just continues. Yeah, stupid bike again. Just continues and continues and continues. So. 
Yeah, I'm going to go with the other dirt tracks are wiped out. Alright, back on the bike, start rolling. Temperature is starting to heat up, so it won't be long before I'm done. And this is why you should stay out of the water. The pressure of this water is becoming insane. But seeing all that stuff actually gives you an idea how quick this water is moving. What about on this side? Oh, look at that. And swap. Unless you're out for here, it's actually really hard to believe. I don't believe any camera, any video, any anything can actually show you what's really happening. But at the same time, if I wasn't living here and seeing it with my own eyes, I'd be a bit worried. I'd stay away. I wouldn't be jumping in there with a kayak anytime soon. If anybody's seen videos, my videos before, you would know this little path would lead you down to a whole heap of dirt jumps, which would definitely all be gone now. Not going any further, not trusting any anything. We got every type of animal here, so it's just best not to play. Right through there would have been jumps. So, all the bike riders and BMX riders, motorbike riders, we're all going to have a little bit of work to do getting all our little tracks up and running again. I think now there is literally only one at the moment and that's the dirt pit hole behind the high school. But this is still the water right behind the big four caravan park. Coming straight up to the Riverbend caravan park. Was home to many of kangaroos. God knows where they've gone.
right up to the big four caravan front door. Damn. Not cool. But it all could have been stopped beforehand. We're going to cross the road in a second. But people should be warned if they do it, are coming out this way. Please respect people. And um, wait till the truck goes past. Another one to come. But yeah, just respect people's privacy. If there's a sign saying do not enter, do not enter. Alright, bring a bridge. Where the bridge is still open for anybody who cares. Let's climb the bike again. We're just waiting for the cars to go. Not sponsored. But seriously, if they want to, I'll buy and say no. Alright, I'm over walking, let's start riding again. Almost look like a whirlpool just went past. Was I meant to hit the stop button again? Oh, here we go.
Wow, another tree uprooted. Meh. At least it's not floating under the bridge again. Alright. I'm going to just cross the road and I'll pick you up again there. Only because this is a busy road. Oh. Yeah. Definitely not going this way. Used to be a path under here that you could get to the other side without actually touching the road. But now... Yeah, not going that way. So, I'll go back up the hill, cross the road, and I'll start again once I'm across the road. Alright, we're on the other side. Only as far as we're allowed to go, maybe only to the parklands even. Just so I don't get in the, yeah, can't go too far. Another road sign. You want to play too. But mommy, I want to go play on the playground. <laughs> Holy sh... This is totally, absolutely insane. There's real no words for it. But yeah, this is insane. I want to see the playground.
Sorry for everybody wearing earphones. But like I said, Mummy, I want to go play on the playground. Please, Mummy. I'm going to slide off of that slippery dip. Water slide. Hey. All right, YouTube. We made it from the center of town to the Jane Eliza area, which still looks okay for now. In the housing area, just beyond the river, yeah, the Riverland Irrigation Trust, all the way up to Baringa, and yeah. So, in the comments, tell me if you reckon it's looking bad out there. If it's, we've still got time. Let's hear some of you smarter people than me, because I know there's a lot of you out there, even the. Other reverend said 98 99.5% of you are not subscribed, but uh, not even going there. So just hit the like if you want to see the helmet cam view, hit the subscribe if you want, and leave a comment. And I'll see you in the next day or two. Going across the road again without getting killed. Alright, we made it across. So, until the next video, peace out.